instead of playing ball or standing for the anthem, the NFL's now trying to get criminals off the hook. Countless fans of professional football have made clear that they prefer to keep politics and sports separated, but that hasn't stopped the National Football League from wading further into political issues. In fact, on October 16, the league endorsed the Sentencing Reform and Corrections Act of 2017, a bipartisan criminal justice reform bill, according to the Washington Post. The legislation would cut mandatory minimum sentences for nonviolent drug offenders, give judges more discretion to tailor sentences to individual offenders, and establish programs to prepare low level criminals to re enter society. NFL spokesman Joe Lockhart said the organization decided to endorse the bill as part of its work on equality within the criminal justice system. We felt that this was an issue over the last months, as we have continued to work with our players on issues of equality and on issues of criminal justice reform, that was serviced for us, and we thought it was appropriate to lend our support to it, Lockhart explained. In a letter to legislators, NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell and Seattle Seahawks players Doug Baldwin further expressed the league's support for the bill and promised to help with its passage. The Sentencing Reform and Corrections Act would address many of the issues on which our players have worked to raise awareness of over the last two seasons, the letter read, according to The Hill. Goodell and Baldwin said they believed the bill would improve public safety, increase rehabilitation and strengthen families in an overall positive next step to move our nation forward. Among those addressed in the letter were Senate Judiciary Chairman Chuck Grassley and Senate Minority Whip Dick Durbin, who were responsible for the legislation being introduced. The legislation also earned the support of several other influential groups from across the political spectrum such as the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, the American Civil Liberties Union, the Charles Koch Institute, and Americans for Tax Reform. While criminal justice reform is needed, whether or not the NFL should use its platform to comment on any political issue is a point of contention, particularly in light of the ongoing protests by players who kneel during the national anthem before matchups and the backlash those protests have caused. Many people believe that the players and the organization should stick to their sport, and that their comments on political issues hinder enjoyment of the game itself. In fact, a September poll by Reuters found that 31% of respondents strongly disagreed with athletes making political statements at sporting events. However, the players and the organization continued to thrust themselves into political conversations, such as criminal justice reform legislation instead of figuring out how to handle the ongoing national anthem protests. Like and share this story on Facebook if you think the NFL should stay out of political issues. What do you think about the NFL supporting a bill that would make things easier for certain criminals? Scroll down to comment below, below.